Hey guys. Um, first I'm going to apologize for the sloppiness. I literally woke up like two minutes ago. Um, my daughter is eating her breakfast so I'm going to seize another moment of quiet to do a video. Um, yeah. I have two questions that I need to answer. Um, and I've answered these in the past, but, you know, like I said in my other video, I think a lot of my new subscribers aren't watching a lot of my older videos, so they don't know the answers to these questions, so they ask them again, not knowing that they've already been asked. So, I'm just going to go ahead and answer them again. Um, the first question was, um, when are you planning on having baby number two, and will you do pregnancy vlogs? I've gotten this question a ton before, um... As far as when we will try for another baby, um, it's probably going to be a while. Um, our daughter is 20 months old now. Um, honestly, the plan right now is to start trying in January of 2011. So, in about nine months, I guess, is when we're going to start trying. Depending, and that this is totally up in the air, it very well may change. Um, right now, I'm still in college. My husband's still in college. Um, and we're trying to wait until he gets a new job so we're better off financially and until we, we're closer to being able to move to a bigger house, um, finish school. You know, there's a lot of um, other things that need to factor into it. Um, and if everything doesn't fall into place like we're planning, then we're going to wait until she's like three and a half, which that may be the plan anyway. You know, we haven't discussed it in depth. It's not something that's really up for discussion right now. So, um, but that's kind of the plan. Um, right now, definitively January 2011, but it could honestly be any time during 2011 so but no it will not be this year <laughs> for sure we're not gonna start trying anytime soon um the second question was do you have any tattoos and what what is your opinion on tattoos um my opinion on tattoos you know actually I love tattoos <laughs> that may sound really strange um I don't know I don't have a problem with them at all I just I think they're artistic and I don't know I love like looking at people's tattoos granted some of them are really really stupid um, and cliche and I don't like the little butterflies and the hearts I just think that's very cliche and I think if you're gonna get a tattoo it needs to mean something like seriously mean something to you um, but yeah. And do I have any tattoos? No, I actually don't have any tattoos. Um, but oddly enough, I have an appointment next month, I think on the 19th of May, to actually get my first tattoo. And this is three years in the making. I've known that I wanted one. Um, and I finally, finally, finally found a design that I'm absolutely, absolutely thrilled with. Um, I'm just going to get it in the middle of my, sh like, on my back, like, in between my shoulder blades. Um, I want to be able to hide it. I don't want tattoos being visible for when I graduate college and I'm trying to get a job. I don't think they would hire a teacher with tattoos all over her arms. Um, if they would, I would be completely tatted up and wouldn't even care. But, you know, i got to stay in the real world and understand that that's not always respectful when looking for an employment position. So, those are my reasons for not having a lot of them. My husband doesn't have any tattoos either, but he also wants to get some. So, I don't know. I And the other part of the question was, when your daughter is a teenager and she comes to you wanting a tattoo, are you going to let her get one? Um, probably not. Um, I think if you're going to get one, I don't know. I don't know. It kind of depends on the situation. If she's 18, she can get one if she wants to. I won't have any say in it. But if she's under the age of 18, no, I probably will not allow her to get a tattoo. Um, I think when you're a teenager, your head is kind of in a funny place and you may get a tattoo that you may regret in the future. Um, 
I've been thinking about mine for years and years and years, and I'm finally just now comfortable with the, t the one that I have chosen, and I probably won't ever get another one. I'll probably only get this one. Um, so I think it needs to be something significant and meaningful. Um, but that's not always the case. I know teenagers go out and get all these cliche tattoos on, like, on their necks and arms and whatever, and... Um, in most cases, they end up regretting getting those later on in life, so I would probably try to steer her clear of that. Um, anyway, I hope I answered y'all's questions, um, right. Um, you know, as far as having another baby, if it were up to us, like, fine, if we were where we needed to be, like, financially and done with college... I'd be having another kid right now because <laughs> I always wanted my kids really, really close in age. But as it is, you know, it's not necessarily how many kids you want. It's how many kids you can afford. Um, and while we could probably afford another kid without any problems, um, I don't I don't want to be stretched and stressed out about it. You know, I don't I don't know. It would be difficult if we had another kid right now. So. That's why we're waiting so long. I don't know. I'm hoping between our second and third kid, we, maybe we can have those, our next two kids close together. But Zoe's going to have to be the oldest <laughs> by quite a bit. Because um, we weren't planning on having Zoe either. And circumstances ended up changing our minds. So, anyway, <laughs> I'll quit rambling. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.